That is Bradwell Nuclear Power Station. For 40 years, it powered Britain with cheap and reliable electricity. We used to be a world leader when it came to nuclear power. Britain built the world's first nuclear power plant, and in the 60s, we had more reactors than the rest of the world combined. But something changed. For decades, Britain didn't start a new nuclear power plant. Under the last Labour government, none were started at all. Under the Conservatives, we started two, and I signed up a third in Wales. But there's a problem. Britain is now the most expensive place to build nuclear anywhere in the world. Why? It's partly that stop-start approach, but that's over now. But it's also the mad amount of environmental regulation that we have here, protecting minute amounts of bats and newts and snails and fish that they don't have anywhere else in the world. That's why the environmental report for Sizewell C was 30 times longer than the entire works of Shakespeare. That's mad. Nuclear is the most pro-nature energy source there is. It uses a thousand times less land than wind and solar. To match the same output of Hinkley, you would need a wind farm the size of the New Forest or a solar farm the size of the Isle of Wight. On a small island like ours, where every inch of countryside is precious, that matters. If we want to protect nature and have the cheap, reliable energy that we need, then we need to double down on nuclear. We've laid radical amendments in the Lords to do just that. Labour should back them. We've got to get out of the poverty mindset, which says that Britain can't build anything anymore. We built nuclear in the past. We can do it again. We just need politicians with the courage to change the law and make it happen.